Welcome back everyone. If you have an Android device, any Android phone, OnePlus phone, Samsung, whatever the case is, you need to enable this specific feature within your settings, which is very important. So as far as I know, on a lot of my devices that I've had, it doesn't come pre-enabled, which is very annoying. So basically what this is, it is the find my mobile option within your settings. And basically what it allows you to do is that if you lose your phone, if you know your iPhone, if your Samsung goes missing or your OnePlus or Pixel phone goes missing, you'll be able to actually track it. And there's been a really good update for this specific thing as well. So I'll go ahead and show you how to enable it so I don't waste you guys' time. What you want to do is you want to make your way over to your settings just like so. And then once you're in your setting, you can go ahead and either search for it. It's usually in your advanced settings or security, but instead you can just type in find in your search bar within your settings. And usually the first thing is find my mobile, just like that. So what you want to do is you want to go and click on it. You'll come to this page, as you can see, it's over here. Now what you want to do at this point is to go ahead and just enable this to be on. As you can see, it was off. You'll get this little pop-up. Usually you can just go ahead and sign in with your Google account. I'll go ahead and sign in with this one. Now at this point, you'll have to type in your phone number, I guess. Now for me personally, I'm not really going to do it because I don't have my other phone on me, but usually you would go ahead and type in your phone number here. And then at this point, you'll be able to actually authenticate and turn on Find My Mobile. Now. These other two options down here, which you can enable afterwards, are remote unlock and send last location, which I would highly recommend you to do. Now, a really good thing, now this is enabled, I know it says the Samsung thing or whatever, you can do this on your Pixel phone, it's the exact same process. Now, what I would recommend you doing after this point is copying down this specific link, the findmymobile.samsung.com, just remember it, keep it on a URL or whatever, you can go ahead and open it on your device just like this. Or if you have a separate device or if you have your separate device you can go ahead and you know bring it in this way and this is where you'll basically be able to find your specific device if it goes missing now a really good update which i'm pretty sure is accessible on all phones is that even if your device is turned off it'll still be able to ping at the last place that it was i believe and or even you know current updates every so often which I think is a really, really important feature. So in case you don't plan on losing your phone or whatever, it's still very important to have it on just in case you do lose it. Again, like I stated before, you don't want to turn it on after because you want to turn it on before. So in case you do lose your phone, you can still have access to at least some information and at least see where it's at. You know, if it's under your bed, then you'll be able to find it because, you know, it's obviously, you know, near you. But if it's gone, if it's a couple streets over or something, then, you know, chances are, it's good to have that type of information than not having it at all. So like I said, the process is pretty much the same on either Pixel or OnePlus. Just go into your settings, typing in Find My or Find My Mobile or typing in, you know, Lost Phone or something, and you'll be able to find that option within your settings. So that's really pretty much it. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So it means so much if you guys get hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my second channel. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.